What can run at a speed of 57 km per hour when chasing a prey? It is an excellent swimmer and a mountain climber, and it can pull its prey up the tall trees to enjoy his own feast away from other predators. It is none other than the leopard, an animal endowed by Mother Nature with more gifts than other carnivores. It is the terror of many animals, including those that eat meat. So what about that fear? Join us to watch today's video to see it all. The Classic Huntings of the Leopard Panthera pardus, commonly known as the leopard, is one of five species of big cats of the genus Panthera that live in Africa and Asia. They are from 1 to nearly 2 meters long, weighing from 30 to 90 kilograms, and their legendary prowess and ability to eat anything from scrabs and up have made them the most successful living feline. They have a special ability to adapt, although their habitat is mainly associated with the savanna, the grassland and the tropical forests. Besides, it is known for its good climbing ability, and it often rests on tree branches during the day, as the leopard relies mainly on its keen senses of hearing and sight to hunt. With a number of physical features, the habitat and the social behavior have signaled the skilled hunting of this leopard. The Leopard Hunts an Impala One fine day, when the leopard was hungry, it went looking for food. Suddenly, it seemed to hear a strange noise from somewhere. Once it had determined the direction of the sound, it immediately climbs up a tall tree to observe. Thanks to its body length of one to two meters, and a good climbing ability, it can approach the prey within range of five meters. In the distance, over there, a number of impalas engrossed on their search for food, and they were caught in the gaze of the leopard. The impala is an African antelope with a body height of 75 to 95 centimeters. Despite having a larger body size than the leopard, the impala is extremely terrified of his animal. Specifically, when the location of the prey has been determined, the leopard quickly moves to the position of the prey. The antelopes do not pay attention to everything around them, so when leopards appear, they are extremely scared. They ran around, moving in many different directions to escape the leopard's sight. Because of its keen senses and excellent hunting skills, an impala did not escape its pursuit. After catching the prey, it frantically grips the prey. To preserve life, the antelope fought back fiercely, and it seemed that only the sound of their fierce fighting could be heard in the forest right now. But strangling until he suffocated, the leopard defeated the impala. It can catch larger prey thanks to its huge skull and powerful jaw muscles, and is therefore strong enough to pull a carcass heavier than itself up a tree. Smaller prey is usually eaten by the leopards immediately, while larger prey is dragged for more than a few hundred meters and safely hidden in trees, bushes or even caves for later consumption. Thus, it can be seen that even though it is larger than the leopard, when faced with it, the impala is still its delicious meal. The leopard hunts an African rock python. In the video below recorded, the case of the leopard, among countless prey to choose from, it found an extremely heavy opponent, the python, and it conquered it. The African rock python is the largest snake in the continent. The adult rock pythons are up to 7 meters long, and can grow up to even 10 meters. They are suitable for many habitats, including savannas, forests, desert, semi-deserts, rocky areas, and even swamps, rivers, and lakes. The African rock python are considered predatory and very aggressive, and they often attack humans. Every year, there are hundreds of records of rock python attacking people, and there are also many cases where they swallow the children, and even adults. Like other python species, the African rock pythons are not venomous, 
and they kill their prey by wrapping and squeezing them to death. Leopards, when faced with ferocious African rock pythons, who will win? This is a question that must be asked by many people. In fact, the fierce battle between a predatory animal with the strength and the agility and a large reptile with the power to wrap and squeeze take place on the other. Although the leopard is the first to attack, but with its intelligence, the rock python can still use its body to wrap the leopard inside. This is a familiar attack of pythons when hunting. With its strength, it will squeeze and make the prey's bones break, and then swallow it. For a moment, it seemed that the leopard had given up, when it began to show signs of suffocation. When suddenly, with its natural agility, it broke free of the python's tutelage and returned to retaliate with a blow, then a scratch, and the bite is his forte. And in the end, victory called the leopard's name, and the fatal wounds all over the body made the python unable to stand in the fight for survival and had to accept to become a meal for the victor. Thus, although the leopard had good hunting skills, but when it faces a heavy opponent like the African rock python, it has to make full use of its abilities to defeat its prey. The Leopard Hunts a Daikur The video below records the image of the battle between leopards and a daikur. While looking for food, suddenly a daikur came into its sights. Daikurs are shy and elusive creatures, and prefer dense shrubs. They mainly graze on shrub shoots instead of grass, and they eat leaves, branches, seeds, fruits, shoots and barks, and often follow flocks of birds or monkeys to eat the fruit dropped by the birds and the monkeys. They supplement their diet with meat, and they sometimes eat insects and carrion, and even capture rodents or smaller birds. It is known that it is a battle, and the daikur is not an opponent of leopards. Once it has detected its prey, it quickly approaches the prey with the closest distance, and the leopard then tries to use its own body weight to push Daker to the ground. And at this point, the Daker's cry made the leopard work harder to kill its prey, because this sound can attract other nearby hunters. And after a while, the Daker becomes motionless. By biting the neck of the prey, the leopard defeated the Daker. Thanks to its huge skull and its powerful jaw muscles, the leopard pulls its prey up a tree and enjoys the fruit. Thus, leopards are carnivores that can hunt more types of prey than any other big cat species with skilled hunting skills. They can eat from small animals such as insects, rodents, fish or even larger animals. And to continue watching out for our videos on YouTube, then please click the like, subscribe and follow us. Have a good day, goodbye and see you in the next videos.